Now let's take a look at a few of the switcher's many video memory functions. The AVHS 410 can save two still pictures and two video clips to internal memory. Now we'll save two still pictures and one simple video clip. Press the VMEM button. The menu indicates that the source is still one. At the REC1 column, set an auxiliary bus number for input. In this case, we'll select auxiliary one. Currently, video memory three is set to record lock on and we will change it to record lock off. Select recording video from B bus and press rec button. The still picture is memorized and displayed in a small window position six of the multi-viewer screen. Now we'll add one more still picture. Select still two from the menu with dial F2. Because we will record from the computer graphics source, the input is again auxiliary one. Press rec button. The still picture is memorized and displayed in a small window, position seven. Next, we will use the motion clip memory function to record and playback a video clip. Select the menu to clip one using dial F2. To change the source video for Rec1, select Auxiliary 3. Selecting a video source and pressing the Rec button of Video Memory 1 will start the recording. Approximately 20 seconds of motion video will be recorded. When you want to stop the recording, press stop using dial F5. As you see here, the recorded motion video is displayed on position eight of multi-view screen. This video can be played back in several modes. For now, we will use loop playback operation. First, select loop in the play mode selection of clip one. Then press the dial for video memory one and loop playback will start.